Hello everyone, it's Graham from Lakeside and I thought I'd just do a very quick uh, Friday evening update. Um, I've finished the paving on the platforms 1 and 2 um, and I've just transferred the buildings over which were on there onto this side just to give me an idea of how this would look. Um, I've put a piece of tarmac underneath the shelter to give it something to stand on because during a refurb that takes some of the paper slabs up and they tarmacked it so um, and I've just put a light pencil line on the edge of the card to hide up the white of the card um, and I may once I've decided on the exact position I may cut this shape out from here and sink that tarmac in rather than it sitting on top but I can't really do that until I've decided on the final position because I've got a bridge to go in here yet from here to over to there so I need to get that built so that I can determine the position of the bridge and then that will then be placed in the correct position um, so that's really basically the platform now I've got from model rail scenery some yellow lines to put down on the inner edge of the platform. They're coming hopefully Tuesday-ish, so I can pop those down. Then I've got the same process to do for that platform. And then that'll be those two platforms covered. Um, then all I've got to do is uh, install lighting. Um, paint the buildings obviously now in blue instead of green and the superstructure up there that will be blue doors will be blue etc modern vending machines on there etc etc modern looking seating people uh, all the other paraphernalia you'll see on the platform So that's that, um, and also what I've been doing today is trying to sort out this lot down here. And now a lot of those boxes are now empty, so the boxes can be stored away. But what I have done is I've built one of three drawers, and this is the first drawer. So this drawer is for steamers the second drawer up from that will be diesels and then the third drawer up for that will be coaches and rolling stock whether I get all my coaches in the third drawer I don't know but it's worked out very well well I think it has anyway so it's just a case of sliding the drawer out on its runners so I've got complete access in this case to the steamers and they've all fitted in very well. So that's all my steamers now, all in one place. So I can just look now without going to the boxes or thinking what haven't I run recently. I can now just look in the drawer and go, oh, okay, that time I'll run that. <clears throat> so it's very easy to pick out now. There's no plastic, tiny plastic things popping off as you open the box. Um, I can just get hold of them and place them on the track with reasonable safety. Well, certainly more safety than uh, trying to get them out of the boxes. I don't know if it's me or not, but every time I open a box, I, I see this little black plastic thing fly off, never to be seen again. So, and back it slides. Now, I was contemplating putting track, bring this out again, um, putting track on the base, but the space of the track meant that um, I wouldn't have had so many lines uh, of locos. So I thought, okay, what I'll do, I will line the bottom of the hole of the drawer with some kind of felt something like that, beige, uh, not beige, baize, 
um, so that it just protects the wheels rather than sitting on the MDF. <coughs> um, so I need to get some felt on a roll I think and line it with that. Um, I put 12 coaches here which are the coaches for the two coronation class I've got here. So rather than try and hunt for the coaches for those, um, they're going to be sitting here. So there's, I've got the whole set there then if I need to get them on the track. Um, and I've got handles here to fit on, like so. And there'll be a um, a wooden front screwed to the front of this so that it would just neaten it up a bit and they're soft closing on those runners so all in all a good day's work there I've just so I've just got another um, two more to build now I've done one then the other two shouldn't be quite so time taking so I'm pleased with that, so that means now a lot of those boxes over there can now be stored away um, in the eaves up here behind that. Oh, I've, I've got entry there, there and behind there and likewise on the other side of the room. So I've got plenty of access to get the boxes in and that one comes out from underneath so I've still, I can still access, access the ease from even from that one, even though it looks like I can't, I can by just bringing it out from underneath. Uh, right, so that about sums it up. Just a very quick update. But I'm really pleased with that draw. It's going to solve a lot of problems. Good, okay, um, I'll end it there and I'll maybe do a running session over the weekend. I'll see how it goes. Okay, so bye for now and uh, have a lovely Easter. Okay, so bye.